Hello, my name is Jeremy. This is Red Means Recording. Today, I'm going to show you Tempera, a new granular instrument from the makers of Vector Synth. Tempera has eight vertical columns that represent a sample. You can load up to eight samples in, and as you play up or down, you scrub through the sample. Samples are stereo and can be varying lengths. There's an onboard keyboard where you can set multiple notes. It's polyphonic, and you can have those notes hold if you want. You can also play it with an external keyboard, like this key step plugged directly in via USB. There are four granular emitters that can have four completely different settings and be applied on the panel. Spray will cause the grains to spray up or down through the sample itself, or left and right through other samples. There are multiple modulators with multiple shapes that can be applied to almost everything. Here's an LFO traveling through the Y-axis, which is the position in the sample itself. There's also a reverb, which you can hear the tale of now. You can lock emitters onto some position on the grid and then play other emitters over them. Emitters can also be synced to tempo so you can get timed granular chunks. And these can be played polyphonically, which is frankly wonderful. By combining different emitters in different positions in the sample and different samples, you can get just wonderful soundscapes out of this thing. This is all content that I have made for the Tempura as I've been alpha testing it over the last week or so. This is that reverb. That's nice. Here's another example using horror sort of sounds where each sample is a different expression of some kind of spooky soundscape. Granular is such a magical tool for soundscapes and atmospheres. This is one of my favorites. These are orchestral samples that I created. Bass, cello, viola, violin, brass, flutes, and a timpani. Each sample goes through a swell so depending on where I hold down the sample's position, I get soft or more intense, and I can play this polyphonically. It's a granular orchestra. There's the timpani all the way on the right. The LFO is now moving through the sample position.
bravissimo. This is a series of sampled voices from Clevgrand's tomophone. Some are in middle C, some are in F, and some are in G. By creating spray and an LFO that travels through the X axis horizontally, I move through all the samples, creating new shifts in timbre and in harmonic relationships. Of course, we could switch to timed grains and get a really cool, <laughs> really cool little tempo thing. We can combine multiple emitters here. This is one of my favorite things to do with this device. These are all samples I made in pigments that are sweeps through wavetable positions. I've added a filter within Tempura. Now I sort of have an eight times multi-tambral wavetable synth that can be played polyphonically with granular modulation throughout. Remember, up and down is through the position of a sample, in this case, the sweep of the wavetable. Left and right are the different samples. So each vertical silo represents a sample. Each color you see represents one of the four emitters. The emitters have a color associated with them, so that's why you're seeing multiple colors on the screen. Here's just a few interesting soundscapes that I made where each sample is sort of a collection of, of morphogene reel kind of feels. This thing is very good at creating granular soundscapes. Reminds me a lot of Borderlands on iOS, which is a huge compliment. Tempura will be showing at Superbooth 2023. This video should be going out right before that. I am happy to have been sort of alpha beta testing this thing and making content for it, which you'll probably be able to check out at Superbooth. Not sure when this is coming out uh, to the public. I'm sure there'll be more information at Superbooth. I think it's really cool. everything goes right, I'll be at Superbooth too, so I hope to see you there. My name is Jeremy. This is Red Means Recording. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day.